Hi friends, we are going to write using scribe the letter D. So when I look at my paper, I'm gonna see that there is basement, living room, and an attic. Let's look at that letter D. Where do you see the round belly of the D? That round belly is in the living room, but it also has a line that goes from the attic all the way down to the bottom of the first floor. So when we write it, I'm gonna get my scribble on. We're gonna start it in the living room like you're writing the letter C. So everything starting that we've learned so far is starting like the letter C. So we start in the living room, we go around. We're going to pick up our pencil. I have to go back to scribble. And we're gonna go to the attic and come down into the living room, all right? It's kind of like making a C with a line right through it. Easy peasy, you can make a C, you can make a D. All right, so the letter D starts like I'm starting the letter C in the living room. I go around. I'm going to pick up my pencil. When I'm using Scribble, I need to re-click Scribble. I'm gonna start in the attic and go down. Now, because we are learning to write D, we're also learning the sound D, and we're also learning to read D. When we write it and see it and say it, we're learning all three of those. So we're going to write and say the letter D and the sound of D. Ready? D, oops. It does that every once in a while, and that's okay. All right. I'm going to arrange this, move to the back. Oh, okay. Let's try again. Okay, we make mistakes, that's all right. Ready? D says duh. There we go. All right. Ooh, where'd it go? Don't know. Try again. D says duh. Will you stay? Let's see, it does, woohoo. All right, guys, so you are writing letter D. D says duh, you're starting it like the letter C and giving it a line that begins from the attic down. It's your turn.